So hello guys, um, today is July 7th and it's time for my embolization glue treatment. Um, I just got here maybe about 30 minutes ago um, when I first arrived, <coughs> of course I had to sign in. Um, they made me wipe my whole body down with these sterile wipes, they were kind of hot, um, just so like, I don't know, I could be sterilized. I had to put this gown on, I had to put this cap on. Um, they just started an IV in my arm for when the anesthesiologist gets ready to come in. I haven't met with my neurosurgeon yet, but he'll be in shortly. Um, my procedure is about to start soon at 12. Um, I just wanted to let you guys know and I will keep you updated more throughout the process as more people come in. They've already took my blood pressure and my temperature and I'm doing fine for the day. I know you guys can't see my hair, but my eyeballs is still on fleek. Um, but yeah, so I'll see you guys in a little while, okay? We're doing the embolization of my frontal lobe ABM. Yes, absolutely. Any questions you can offer? No, not Okay. Dr. Reeve Campbell will be by shortly, okay? okay? Um, as well as your anesthesia providers and the nurses from the operating room. Okay. Okay, so it won't be long until they, they're finishing up with the case right in front of you right now. Okay. So they'll be coming by shortly, all right? All right. Thank you very much. And you did a birth seven, three, nine, nine. Awesome. All right. And any allergies to anything that you know of? Okay. Um, have you ever had any sensitivities to latex or anything like that? Okay. Perfect. Have you had any surgeries before? Mm -hmm. Have they put any metal in your body anywhere? No. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, you able to walk around okay? Have any balance issues or range of motion issues? Okay. Or any glasses or contacts? Any hearing aids or partial dentures? Anything? Okay. All right. Did they put one of those heart-shaped stickers on your backside? Yes. Okay. Perfect. Any cuts, scrapes, or bruises on your body anywhere? Oh, I also had like a burn from my job. What are we doing for you today in your office? Um, embolization. Um, Alright, and what side are we doing it on? The left. Left side? Okay. Sounds good. They talked to you about going through your groin? Yeah, I remember okay. from the angiogram. The angiogram. Okay. Alright. Um, you'll probably remember this last time too, but I like to warn everybody, you'll have to lay flat for two hours afterwards. Just yeah, to make sure that site doesn't lay for four hours. Yeah. And then when they try to get me up after two, it started to bleed? Yeah. Oh no. Yeah. Well, hopefully that doesn't happen this time. Do yeah. <laughs> you have any questions about anything at all? Um, no. No? Okay. Well, we'll take good care of you. Thank you. I yeah. appreciate it. No problem. <laughs> See your blood consent. All right. Um, and Dr. Reeve Campbell should be in shortly to come see you. Okay. All right. All right. I'll see you back there, okay? Okay. Thank you. Right. Thank you, guys. All right. You have any questions about anything? Not really. Um, I'm just, you know, looking for the best. Yes. No, we're going to do everything. I know you're going to take care of me. Like we're going to do day. everything, everything <laughs> in our power to make it as safe as possible. I mean, that's like, safety is the, no, the number one priority. So. just woke up I think I look pre kind of pretty to be just waking up but it's been a long night hopefully I get discharged in a few 
Um, it is now 8, uh, what is this? Almost 8.30. I'm sorry, my eyes are like... Um, what I experienced was a little headache after the procedure, but I couldn't sleep really throughout the night because I wasn't at home. My fiance stayed with me. He had to leave this morning though to go to work. So my best friend will be here in a couple hours and I'll record again and keep you guys updated, okay? Thank you and thank everyone for praying for me. Love you guys. So right now it's about 6 p.m. and I literally just got home. Um, I got discharged, I wanna say around five o'clock. <clears throat> so what I experienced, um, I basically told you guys, but I don't think I uh, I'm told you guys more in depth. So this whole procedure was um, the pre-procedure to my actual brain surgery that's going to be on August 16th, 2016 of this year. So what they had to do to me yesterday was inject a catheter um, into my femoral artery in my leg, um, my growing area, and um, they, what they do is feed it all the way up to an artery in my vein, I mean in my brain, sorry. And um, when they get to the tangle of blood vessels that I have, which is the AVM, which is the abnormality that I was born with, um, when they get to that, they inject this solution called onyx glue. Now, the glue is to basically glue my arteries, cutting off the circulation to those feeding arteries to the AVM that aren't supposed to be there. And the reason why they do this is so when they go to do my surgery, they know exactly what they're looking for to take out, which is the glue. And um, you have less chance of, you know, bleeding out, less blood, less messiness. So this was the procedure that they had to do before um, August 16th. Now they were only able to obliterate 40% yesterday of my AVM with glue. So I'm actually gonna be going back on August 15th to get the 60% um, that's left obliterated. And when I wake up in the morning on the 16th, that's when I'm going to have the actual brain surgery. Um, so I'm just glad everything was a success. Um, I learned a lot of things about being in the ICU unit today. Um, it was a learning experience. Some people were there who had strokes. Some people had, you know, the actual brain surgery. Um, but for me, I felt like everything was different. I was actually able to get up, eat, walk around. They were pretty shocked with me. Like they were like, you're just smiling. You just keep smiling. And I'm like, I don't know what else to do. <laughs> like I don't feel any pain. So I'm going to smile because I'm excited. Like I'm happy that I didn't have any side effects. And I thank God that I didn't have any. Um, my friends and family stood by my side the whole time and I just want to say thank you guys for that and I will be making another video soon um to let you guys know about the actual surgery part okay take care and thank you love you guys bye